I'm saying that looking at all of the evidence, the best contender for an explanation currently is a thing called a whale's catfish. It doesn't mean that tomorrow, if a four-foot-long neck sticks up out of the loch behind me here, it doesn't mean I'm not going to photograph it because it doesn't fit with the picture of a whale's catfish. At the moment, that's my best guess as to the answer. But it's still the world's greatest mystery as I speak. But given that you've, you've spent 25 years looking for it, given that we've had all sorts of pinger devices going up and down that lock looking for Nessie, no sign whatsoever, is it time to give up and say that actually there isn't a Loch Ness monster? Uh, well, I, I don't know where you are, but if you sit here, then you wouldn't be able to say no sign whatsoever because we have a steady trickle of information OK, in, later, in the last few years, we only get one or two decent sightings a year. But we get sonar contacts with things that are just far bigger than any fish that should live in this body of water. We get, you've got so much evidence to put into one jigsaw puzzle, but still we haven't got the overall picture. All I'm currently saying is that looking at all the evidence, talking to all the eyewitnesses, the most, co the most likely solution is a thing called a whale's catfish. Maybe I'm not saying that's the answer. I'm not, say, I'm not saying the mystery is solved for one minute, and I'm not saying I'm about to stop. I'm still looking for a better explanation than that. Maybe it's a Russian submarine. Well, I think if we had a Russian submarine in Loch Ness, then that would be a world-class incident in it, mystery in itself. So if I end up photographing that, then so be it. But if we can't find a monster, we wouldn't be able to find a submarine, would we? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I suppose yeah. you're right. Yeah, I don't know. It'd have to, it would have to come in by road, though, wouldn't it? So I think we'd see it coming through the centre of Inverness. Yeah, you've got a point. I suppose the same with the monster, but maybe not. I mean, 25 years on the edge of the loch, looking for the Loch Ness Monster, not found him, given up your home, given up your job, given up your girlfriend. Was it all worth it? It's, uh, I'm absolutely and utterly in my utopia living here on the shores of the loch, trying to solve what I say is one of the world's greatest mysteries. And the more that an individual looks at the evidence, the more you realise we do have something to be explained here. We, people are seeing something bigger than our biggest animals that we get in the water here that we know of, are salmon, that, uh, salmon or seals that occasionally come in chasing those salmon. And these things are the size of an estate car that we're getting sonar contacts with. So I'm here to identify that. I'm quite happy doing that as well. Steve, 25 years you've been doing it. Sky News has been on the air longer than 25 years. And the joke used to be in the early days that more people had seen the Loch Ness Monster than had seen Sky News. Now something like 130 million people see Sky News and still nobody's seen the Loch Ness Monster. How many people go to church every Sunday? We've got photographs of Nessie, we've got sonar contacts, we've got eyewitness accounts. We've got more evidence than there is for God. You're not, you're not comparing Nessie to God, though, are you? I'm not comparing. It's not the same thing. This is, this is an explainable phenomena. OK, but you're going to carry on? Uh, yeah, I'm here for the next decade, yeah. Unless I go and solve it. If tomorrow I get the conclusive proof of whatever's in here then that's me, I'll have, I'll have to go off and solve another lakes monster, international monster hunter, that's my next career, once I solve this one. Well, uh, good luck to you. Maybe she just appears when you've gone to sleep or something, I don't know. Well, I've covered that possibility occasionally, so, uh, yeah. We've still not solved it yet, but no. the mystery still remains. There is something to be explained in Loch Ness. Absolutely. Maybe you'll chat to us uh, if you do find her, or him. Don't know which one it is. But it's great to talk to you, Steve. Thanks so much indeed for joining us. Thank you.